Hi and welcome back. For trimester 3, we're having main three topics. Topic number one will be Microsoft PowerPoint. Topic number two will be My Media as a digital citizenship topic. Topic number three will be Express Course from Code.org where we're going to learn more about programming and by the end of the course, you can create a small game or an artist project. For our project this term, we're having designing a game using Sprite Lab or Artist Lab from Code.org. As I said, our first topic will be Microsoft PowerPoint. One, we're going to learn how to create an animated GIF. Do you know what are GIF? If you don't know, we're going to search Google for GIF. Open Google. Okay. Search Google images. Yes, GIF is a type of images. In the type in the searching bar, we're going to type smiley face GIF here we have different GIF click one of them wait until it loads yes GIF are the animated photos which do funny stuff moves in a cute way I know you're familiar with them you saw them a lot on Facebook on WhatsApp and so on here we have another one okay to create gif we're having like seven steps step number one will be inserting the first picture in slide one so we're going to open powerpoint from my programs search for powerpoint Then we're going to download two images from Google Images. We're going to search for smiley face images, smiley face. Okay, I need this one, so right click, save image as. We're going to save them on downloads, change the name of the image to be face one save okay scroll down to search for second one mm. we're searching for a different one okay yes here we have a nice one again right click save as change its name to be Phase two. Okay, now we're having two images. We're going back to PowerPoint file from insert tab, click texture to insert your image. Do you know where did we save them? Yes. We saved them on downloads, so click on downloads, select the first one. We need to create a new slide to add the second image. So from the home tab, click new slide, or you can create a new slide from the keyboard by clicking Control M. Control M will create a new slide. So insert, yes, add the second one, move back to slide number one, resize your image from the corner, selecting your image, move to format from align, make sure to change 
the image aligned to be to the center and middle do the same was the second one resize select format align change it to be centered and to the middle okay moving back to the retina steps we're done with step number one inserting the two images step one and step two step three we adjusted the alignment of the two images to the center and to the middle of the slide step number four will be saving your pictures as GIF from file save as select the format to be GIF graphics interchange format okay save before saving we're going to rename the presentation in a meaningful name make it smile okay we're gonna save them to documents make sure to select every slide if we select current slide only we're going to save only slide number two or the selected slide as GIF so we're going to select every slide okay has given us a confirmation a confirmation message that each file will be saved it as a separated file in folder C users document in a folder named it smile okay scroll down to know the fifth step which will be opening www.ezgif.com and upload the two GIFs we just created to create the GIF okay just copy and paste the address of the site to the address bar in Google Chrome definitely we're going to create a GIF so select a GIF maker choose file move to documents select smile folder okay actually I had an older folder an old folder with the same name okay select the two images okay by the mouse click on any empty place then drag the mouse to select the two images or you may do it from the keyboard by selecting control a control a select all or drag the mouse to select both images okay open upload and make a gif okay scroll down make a GIF okay here we have a preview for our GIF scroll down last step will be saving the GIF to your PC by clicking save okay now we're having our GIF saved it to our PC right click show in folder to see how it looks like open yes we're done with creating the GIF